Ever wonder how an ancient philosophy could impact your life today? Stoicism, with its emphasis on self-control, reason, and accepting the present moment, has become increasingly popular. But is it all sunshine and serenity? Let's explore a potential dark side, the idea that Stoicism, when taken too far, might be hindering modern society. Stoicism, practiced by Roman emperors and philosophers alike, teaches us to control our emotions and focus on virtue. It's about accepting what we cannot change and focusing on what we can control, our thoughts and actions. Sounds pretty good, right? But here's the rub. What happens when Stoicism becomes an excuse to suppress emotions altogether? Imagine a world where men are discouraged from expressing sadness, anger, or even deep love, all in the name of Stoic control. This emotional suppression can have serious consequences. Studies show that bottling up emotions can lead to anxiety, depression, and even physical health problems. Furthermore, it creates a barrier to connection. Empathy thrives on vulnerability, and if men are constantly putting on a stoic facade, how can they truly connect with others? Think of a leader who, in the name of stoicism, remained indifferent to the suffering of his people. Their emotional needs were disregarded, leading to social unrest or missed opportunities for progress. Stoicism, when misused, can become a shield against compassion. Let's be clear, stoicism has valuable lessons to teach. But a balanced approach is key. Stoicism isn't about becoming emotionless robots. It's about managing emotions, not eliminating them. So, the next time you feel a surge of emotion, don't shut it down. Acknowledge it, understand it, and express it healthily. That's how we build strong relationships and create a more compassionate society. What are your thoughts on the role of emotions in today's world? How can we achieve balance between reason and passion? Let's keep the conversation going in the comments below.